K1 Sammy living life here in Guangham Moon Plaza. I am going to talk to you today about this beautiful public space. This was created in 2009 by the city of Seoul. It's a public space, open to the public. We have lots of amazing things in history according to this. So in the background here, we have Admiral E, which is a famous naval admiral. And in the background, I'm going to show you that in one moment, is King Sejong. Now, King Sejong is one of the most famous figures in Korea. And what he did was uh, created the alphabet, the Hangul alphabet. And he created that in the 15th century. That alphabet was able to give the Korean people a way to communicate with each other easily and simply. It was not just for the elite, not just for the rich and the powerful. He brought language and education to the masses. So he was very famous and popular for that. He adorns the uh, currency here in Korea as well. So that's another thing. Now this public square was, like I said, created in 2009 by the city of Seoul for the people. It's a public space. We have some very historic and modern buildings around here as well. We have the American Embassy over here. We have the National Police Headquarters. And we also have some museums. We have the King Sejong Museum. We have the National Arts Museum. We have uh, the President's House in the background. And we also have City Hall, which is just down the street. So today we're also going to visit the City Hall. We're going to visit Cheonggichong River. And in the background, you can see right over there is the King Sejong statue. And behind it, is the palace. We're gonna watch the changing of the guards and part of the idea of Korean feng shui, if you would wanna say it, is that you have the mountains in the background and the water in the foreground. So just down here is also the river. So this is the perfect place to build a palace. Let's take a look down and see what's going on down here, okay? Back in Guangham Moon Square, here we are. Today, what they're gonna be having, what I think they're gonna be having, is a open market. So where you can enjoy food and traditional Korean uh, things. So let's go take a look and see what's going on here today, all right? Follow me. Over here on this side, what we have is, uh, I brought my friend here a while ago. And this is, you can get your name written in Korean scroll. And it's actually not very expensive. It's about 10,000 won, 20,000 won, and it's your name and today's date and, and where you were, all written in beautiful Korean script, like traditional Korean script, hand drawn by an artisan. And you can get that as a souvenir. Over here on this side, over here, what we have is a booth where you can actually rent a traditional hanbok, which is the traditional Korean dress for men and for women and you can rent that and wear it for a short period of time. So let's go take a look at the uh, marketplace and see what's going on here today. So over here we have the National Arts Museum, uh, concert hall and presentation center. Very cultural area. Over on the other side you can't see it but it's on behind these two buildings here behind this tent right here we have the Korean uh, intelligence agency office and right next door is the American Embassy. High security, um, right across from a public square. So let's go walk down here and take a look. Hello there. So what we have is uh, again oil. traditional oils. Yeah. Over this side we got some mm -hmm. oh, tteokbokki. That's my favorite. Spicy, yeah. spicy yeah. and spicy yeah. 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 some uh, yeah. hot sauce. So this is uh, like a farmer's market here today. We got fruits, of course, your traditional kimchi, the best thing of, about Korea. Okay, so you got your different kinds. This is your traditional kimchi. So you got a lot of government agencies around here, a lot of uh, government offices. But you also have, like I said, this is a public square where everyone can come from. Anyone can come and enjoy uh, the open open area and open spaces. So where we're going to go right now is we're going to go over to the palace. We're going to walk over to the palace. We're going to take a look at the changing of the guard. Uh, traditional changing of the guard uh, in their costumes and uh, see what we can see over there.
welcome back. And uh, today is a holiday. Today's holiday is called Children's Day. The holiday was actually yesterday on Sunday, but today what they've done is moved it to the Monday so that people could have a long weekend. Now, Children's Day is traditionally a day where children are celebrated. And uh, today what they're doing in the public square is games and events for the family. So that's what they have here today. They have all these little games and traditional celebrations of uh, culture and history to celebrate the family. So that's what's going on here today at Guangkamun Square on Children's Day in Seoul, South Korea. So we're back in uh, Guangamun Square and in front of the palace, as you can see, the palace is quite ornate, quite uh, beautiful. It has been reconstructed because it was burned down and destroyed, but it is a reconstruction of the original palace for the king. And it's open to the public, it's free to get in, uh, seven days a week, open every day. And they also have the changing of the guards. So we're going to take a look at that. It's nothing spectacular about it, it's just... Uh, showing the grandeur and the size of it. If you've ever been to the Forbidden City in Beijing, it's sort of like the same idea. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over there and take a look at that. Uh, in the previous uh, shot, you would have seen a concert being uh, performed uh, for traditional Korean folk music. And also you would have seen some people wearing traditional Korean clothing, going back to the ancient times and the traditional hanbok dress as well. So enjoy those, we'll be back in a moment. 부모, what you can see here is the traditional palace guards and their authentic clothing that they were wearing uh, back in the uh, 15th century. The guard changing ceremony is going to be about to begin here. So take a look at this and watch uh, how beautiful this traditional palace guard changing uh, is going to be. Alright guys, we're back here at Chonggi Chong Stream. So this is again another public space that the uh, city of Seoul uh, developed in 2009 uh, to open up the city for people who live here to enjoy the public space. And what we have here is the Chonggi Chong Stream. This used to be covered and it was basically a sewer. In the uh, late 1900s, this was a stream and poor people lived in this area. It was covered over and buildings and streets were on here. And now they opened it up and made it into a public area where people will come and enjoy back alley of uh, Seoul City Hall. Now over here to my left is the old City Hall. And what they did was build the new City Hall. So the new City Hall and the old City Hall are uh, again public spaces on the other side that we're going to go over right now uh, before we go over there I wanted to show you this area we're going to take a look at the public space that they have over there as well while they were building and excavating the area for this new building they actually discovered the foundations of some very old buildings from the 1600s which they saved uh, today it's closed uh, unfortunately but inside you can actually see they've covered it over with glass you can stand and look at the excavation that's there very interesting to check out
this comes to the end of our video, I want to say thank you to everybody. If you like what you see, subscribe, hit the subscribe button right there, hit the like button, hit the bell button so you know that other videos are up and ready to see. Today's video was about basic uh, tourist guide of downtown Seoul and the main area within walking distance, five minutes from each other. Three locations that you might want to check out if you're here. And remember, if there is something that you want to find out about, if you want to hear about, if you want me to go check out, if you want to know, ask me a question. Hit the comment, ask me a question. I'll be more than happy to reply back to you. Ichiwan Sammy, out!